but things are good for those folks who really like the warmth, right? They really are. That's, that's me included. You know that. Now, I heard a couple complaints from some true Clevelanders, like you mentioned, who want that white Christmas. But for the most part, how can you be upset about this? Lights are up, Christmas trees are lit, but there's a little something missing here this December. Yeah, normally this outdoor skate park in Lakewood is covered in snow and ice this time of year. Not a soul in sight. Oh, you can't skate on snow. Tonight, this is all you see. 17 years as a skateboarder, Malcolm Willis has never seen a winner start off quite like this. Never, 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 never. So let me throw some weather stats and video at you for a second. This is what it looked like around this time last year. Some snow, temps hovering around the mid-40s. Not bad, right? But our average is closer to a high of 36 and a low of 24. And it's hard to forget how brutal the last couple winters were. Snowing so much, it got really cold like really early. So we had to skate for like indoors for five or six months. Okay, forget about last winter. Let me remind you again what today was like. We hit a high of 57 degrees. It's great, you know, people enjoying themselves, you know, taking advantage of this weather, man, got to. But for everyone in Northeast Ohio, we know not to get too comfortable with what feels downright balmy. Just ask this guy walking around in a t-shirt on December 22nd. One day it's snowing and then the next you're outside growing in no shirt. That's just how it's always been. All right, I'm obviously too much of a wimp to wear anything but five layers out here, but I heard Jason mention some 60s tomorrow, so we'll see. Reporting live in downtown, Homa Bash, News Channel 5.